Herd immunity is a phenomenon that happens when a large portion of the population are vaccinated. It results in a lesser amount of spreading of a contagious disease since less individuals are able to carry it. That sounds really confusing, so let's break it down a bit. Let's say we have a population of 36 beavers. And let's say there's a disease called beaver fever that causes a nasty fever and other flu-like symptoms. It has a 50% chance of being passed on to any beavers that come in contact with a sick individual. So let's say this beaver in the corner gets the disease. We can flip a coin to see if the three beavers right beside him also get sick. We have to then flip a coin for the beavers beside those ones, and then again and again until we've flipped a coin for those beside each infected beaver. Wow, that shows about 60% of our population got infected. This population started with no immunity to the disease, so any organism had a 50% chance of getting the disease if they were exposed to it. So how would this be different for a population with 50% immunity? Maybe 50% of the beavers got their flu shot and therefore cannot get the beaver fever. Let's start with the same beaver in the corner getting sick again and see what happens. As you can see, the virus cannot spread as easily. About half of our population didn't even come into contact with the virus at all. So, why is this so important? Some people in the world are not able to get vaccinations. Newborn babies, the elderly, people with immunodeficiencies, just to name a few. If enough people in the population are vaccinated or are immune, then these people can also be protected through herd immunity. However, recent anti-vaccination movements put these people at risk and increase the spread of contagious diseases throughout the population.